channel is your guest Sally. If you're new, you're most definitely welcome. And if you have not subscribed, please before you leave, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well here the notification bell. And shout out to all my subscribers, all my beautiful sis out there. Thank you so much for tuning in every now and then. I do appreciate you big time for as you can tell your baby girl Sally, she's glowing for fall like seriously, like nobody business as we always do you guys know the deal anyway guys today i'm coming up to you with this kind of fall kind of typical fall vibe ish makeup look and see your girl she's popping in fall check this look out honey what are we thinking what are we not thinking i'm in love with this look like seriously and um yeah by now you guys must have too when you ask me when you when 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 you know me you know i love doing cut crease like cut crease is one of my favorites when it comes to makeup look so i decided to come up with this kind of multi yellow cut crease pink purple going on under crease anyways i use a bunch of eyeshadow to to create this look and which i'm super loving the way it turned out too and of course my lashes is kissing everybody you guys know so yeah i'm into these long lashes at the moment and for my lip combo honey for my lip i'm using the maybelline super stay ink lip oh my days this is so so beautiful so beautiful super affordable and i love the fact that it has a sharpener at the back so you can always always sharp it to the shape of the of the lipstick that it came with so with that you can easily use it to differentiate your lips without you're not staining your lips moving your lips around i'm really, really loving this super super beautiful dark burgundy but the name of this one is uh, still for more which is number 65 go check for it don't sleep on it sis. really i've been checking you know which kind of lipstick am i going to be using for this fall with this winter i wasn't really really having anything on my mind until i bumped into this one in drugstore i saw a review on it on on youtube i think it was uh there was a lady that did a review i can't remember and then i watched the review i was loving it i love the fact that it has a sharpener at the back so that is why when i saw it on drugs so i said no girl you're gonna walk away without no this without this lipstick so i had to grab it they have a bunch of color but this was the one i call for this was the one my attention call for so yeah and i'm loving it kind of remind me of smashbox liquid lipstick but isn't so so beautiful i'm loving this look i'm into it guys enough of the talking 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 because i'm going to sit here and rumble and rumble and tell you about this look like i said i use a bunch of palette to achieve four eyeshadow to achieve this old look anyway guys without any further ado if you are interested you want to see how i achieve this look you already know what to do just stick around and enjoy and please make sure you subscribe give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about this old look i know some of you guys don't really like bold look like this but you know i have to switch up the game sometimes i don't want to make you you i don't want to keep it boring all the time i just want to you know i'm a chameleon i don't love to switch stuff every now and then you got me got me got me got me got me <laughs> you know what i mean anyway guys all the rest products that i use are going to be every product basically it's going to be down below as usual please enjoy and i'm going to see you all in my next video okay 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 check it out so i'm going to be going in with the urban tk primer potion this one is eden the reason why i'm using this one this one has a lot of coverage so it's going to make my eyeshadow pop out perfectly okay just going to apply that right here Luvia brush. I'm just going to gently dab it all over my eyelid. I'm not swiping because I don't want to stain any other place. So that is why I'm just dabbing. With the dabbing emotion, you're going to get a lot of coverage as well. So do not swipe. Just dab, 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 dab. Thank you. 
so guys if you want you can go ahead and set it i'm not going to set it because this primer is already dry and matte to use so to achieve this eye look i'm going to be using a bunch of my palettes i'm going to be using the royal affair palette by bh cosmetic i'm going to be taking this off tropic palette from nyx cosmetics i'm going to be taking ultra mattes from nyx cosmetic i'm going to be taking the uh just peaches matters by Too Faced. so the first palette basically i'm going to be starting with the off tropic palette and i'm taking this brush right here Where's this brush? Where's the brush? Where's the brush? Where's the brush? Where's the brush? Taking this Juvia's Place brush, I'm dipping into this pink right here, and then, <laughs> and I'm just going to go ahead and apply that pink on my crease. So yes, because we are doing a cut crease, guys. So we are doing a curve cut crease, curve cut crease. You see the pygmy that is why i decided to use that uh eyeshadow base because i know when i use that eyeshadow base it's going to pop out like booming you know so i'm just going to go ahead and pack it and pack and pack and pack and then later on i go ahead and blend don't just start blending if you want to have that precise cut crease and you want the color to pop well as you can see i'm doing a cuff cut crease i'm not doing wingy cut crease or half cut crease yeah just go apply it on top on top this look is very simple guys if you know what you're doing it's very very simple and out I'm going to apply setting powder more under my eye in case of any fallout. Go in with this gesso, very kind of small, flat, fluffy brush, and I'm going to be taking in. I'm going to go in with this Juvia's or uh, with this BH Cosmetic Royal Affair palette. I'm going to be taking this taking this shade right here this right here this is kind of a skin tone shade and out the edges before i go in with another shade very very softly As you can see the difference right now so yes that is what i'm going to continue doing until i'm satisfied with how it looks like <sighs> guys this eye look for me is genius it's genius like hey the last palette but not the least i'm going to be going ahead with the two fakes just peaches matters I'm going to be taking this color right here and this one is called chocolate chocolate dropped this one right here I'm going to go in with the same brush I'm just going to apply that for more dimension I want to have a little bit of smoke effect on my outer corner gently transfer it to my inner corner towards my inner corner so as you can see we still have that purple and that pink going on that is what I was just going for all my days guys i love this look already and really stick into my crease because i want my crease to be smoky you know what i mean so when i cut my crease it's going to be very precise so yes we still have the pink going on we still have the purple going on we still have the chocolate deeper dropper going on so sis you gonna struggle you got no problem you gonna stress don't think too much okay just relax relax okay and get your eye done <laughs> so yes we're taking this beautiful orange right here i'm just going to blend the edges together you know so we have a little bit of color on our brow bone area just like so honey just like so you're good to go you are good to go as you can see the transition already 
very softly okay i'm going to go ahead and cut our crease to cut my crease i'm going to be taking the fenty beauty concealer and i'm going to be using this applicator i'm not going to be using airing brushes because i noticed and i discovered when i use the applicator i have more control i have more control than when i use a concealer brush if that makes sense just try it didn't work for you okay be go ahead and cut my crease we are done <laughs> You see what I mean? Super easy, super easy, super easy. Fan, fan. I'm going to fan, 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 fan. For my lid color, I believe right now my lid is a bit dry. I'm going to be taking this eyeshadow brush. This is from Six Plus, and I'm dipping in into this color right here. This is kind of multi color. And it's a very very beautiful color i think you guys have seen me use this on my one of my tutorial here i don't know but i'm just going to basically gently start from where should i start let me start from the middle thinking i'm going to go ahead and apply my wing liner i'm taking the maybelline eye studio gel liner and i'm taking this brush right here i'm just going to line my eye my waterline of course In the shade the one I apply on my lid I'm just going to blow it on my bottom lashes so yes with that pop hole talking what I wanna talk what are we talking I would pull up well uh, guys what are we talking about when i talk when i was thinking are you feeling this look yes so move straight i'm going to go ahead and apply blush i'm going to be taking this blush by catrice and this one is called berry bow berry bow i'm going to be taking this free technique brush i'm just going to use it to apply it on my cheek it's a very beautiful and pigment blush so i just have to be careful um, <laughs> okay so yeah for highlight next level i'm going to be to highlight i'm going to be taking this baker highlighter and taking my bobby brown eye blender brush i've not used this brush for a minute i'm just going to you know kind of highlight my cheekbone like so And my inner corner. Yes, honey. Better than sex mascara on my bottom lashes. Look, put together, I'm going to be taking this NYX matte fine and fine matte long lasting setting spray just for a tiny bit i'm going to go in on top with the max setting spray this is a rose water just a very tiny bit guys for lip color i'm super curious to try this maybelline super stay ink you know it's so so beautiful beautiful and at the bottom you have also sharp now you can always sharp so you can have the exact shape of the lipstick which is super super beautiful
guys what are we thinking this lip combo honey is beautiful i'm going to be right back let me just face my wig i'm going to be right back